What is up guys, it's Moza Nation and we are back with more Far Cry 6. I'm just going to get straight back into it. We needed to see Juan Cortez because <laughs> he rang me and uh, it's a funny conversation. We're here, we're getting Long into time. it. We need you to do some dead drops for the cause. You drop off the Vivido, I pick up the profits. What are they drops for? You try these? I took one for research, now I can't stop. Turn my piss purple, you want one? No. Who's paying us for the Vivido, Juan? Before we slit Castillo's throat, we should ask for more flavors. It's the Yankees. Worse. CIA. The fucking CIA's in bed with Libertad? What's Clara think of that? Well, if she knew, I would hope it'd be something like, Thanks, Juan. I'm so happy to have guns to kill fascists named Castillo. Etc., etc. Freedom costs money. Clara doesn't ask. And I'll never tell. It's a private club. Just you, me, Lighthouses filled with Anton's candy. Clara needs to stay shiny for the people. You're protecting her. I'm not so sure I'm the only one looking out for Clara. Just remember, after La Revolución, she won't have time for a guerrilla like you. Just in case. That's the spirit, guerrilla. All right, guys. Yeah. Um, oh, hang on. I've met La Moral. Why didn't you send me to them first? La Moral. Last I heard, they were a small group, always on the edge of falling apart. They're doing more fighting than the legends. Okay, but watch your step. La Moral has a bad rep, and I don't want Libertad's name to be dragged down with him. I'll keep my eyes open. Right. Yeah. Sorry for getting straight into it, guys. Um, so basically what we're doing is delivering some packages for Juan, although there was kind of a little special bit there about Libertad is working with the CIA. Um, so yeah, uh, I think fast traveling and airdropping is probably the best way to go for these. So that's what I'm going to do. Um, so yeah, we're just delivering uh, Viviero packages for Juan in the CIA, which is really weird. Um, because the character Danny did want to go to... Uh, America, didn't they? Miami. If I say yes, I feel like you're still going to tell me. Fucking drug lords want to stash their cash in American real estate so they can launder it. Fifty million dollar deal, Danny. That's great, Juan. I even got them to throw in a few kilos of product. Sold it on the black market, but lost it all at the tables in Monte Carlo. How is this helping me right now? Nah, I get lonely. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Every time Juan rings or I do a mission for Juan, it's just one of the best ever. So uh, anytime this comes up, I'm going to do them straight away. Uh, yeah. So Libertad is actually in sort of connection with the CIA, which is really strange. Um, because that is where Danny wanted to go. He wanted to go to America. He didn't want to do all this fighting stuff. He just wanted to go to America, get settled there, um, and find a way out. But he ended up getting more involved than he ever thought. So, a bit strange that it's all, well, it's not catching up, but it's all not even linked, really. I don't know what I'm trying to say, guys. <laughs> right, we're at the first drop-off anyway. So, oh, there's a package up there. I'm going to go get that. You know I'm all about that. One down. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Not a sort of parts. But I need to get up. There you go. Is it here I can do it? Well, oh, I can just about grapple. Oh, nice. Just made it. So I don't know what this is. I think it's one of the FND crates. I don't know if it's gunpowder. I don't know if it's a weapon. Either way, I'm going for it. Uh, we're, there it is. Supremo bond. That's not actually a bad one. That's not a bad thing. Right. Where's the next one? Uh, if I airdrop from there, I should be a little bit close. So I should just be able to sort of glide there, you know? There we go. Yeah, a little bit closer. Yeah, so we're just delivering these Vivero packages. Um, and then I think I'm going to get straight back on with some of the missions for... Uh, I don't know whether to do it for El Tigre or La Moral. I think maybe El Tigre. Um, you know, because I've done one for La Moral. It kind of makes sense to sort of split them and sort of do them evenly. 
hopefully the sort of story will catch up with itself in each other's one, you know. Yes, this time I should actually make it just in a wanna. Yeah. Nice. Here we go. <laughs> I don't know why the noise made me laugh, to be honest, but it did. Here we go. Landed. Oh, no. Ooh. It's locked. First package dropped off. Oh. What? Oh. Bienvenido. Shit, the bed. What? The enemy has just as much right to destroy you as you do to destroy them. Ah, Jesus. So, were we supposed to do this one last or something? Jesus, man. So we just got knocked out. I hope for Clara. But I got you. You thought I would have noticed Libertad selling my Viviro to the Yankees? You're a dead man! When the Garillas arrested my family in 67, me, Papa, was dragged to this very cell. I was put in the cell next door. Thirteen. Like you, mijo. We used to talk every single night through this vent. I loved it. His voice taught me to be strong, to be a man. And then the Garillas came. Every day I'm in charge. <laughs> crime by crime, piece by piece he paid to the Garillas. But we were still dark every single night. Until they took his tongue for his lies to Yara. Stop! Papa, stop this! Who is this Guria to you? Ah, I think we should skip a few steps, Raul. Viva Libertad. The attack. The Hotel Paraiso. Danny was there. You? You told me that you hid in the tunnel. Danny could have killed me. Could have given me to Libertad. We have no time for lies. I've stopped running. I've listened. I've learned. I've done everything you have asked. I will be El Presidente. Let Danny go. I am not a monster, Diego. We will give them a chance. Guys, if you could see my reaction then to Diego shooting him in the head. Oh my god, I did not know what the hell to do. I was... You made the deal, took a cut for yourself, and lost it in a dumb bet you can't even remember. Oh, sh shit. Yes? I think this means we are family now. Oh my god, I have no idea how the hell to get out of here. I mean... What the f- where am I supposed to go, man? I went through the vent. What the f- Genuinely, if you could see my reaction though to Diego shooting, I was sat back in my chair, Diego shot him, I was literally Don't wincing. Get the fuck out of here. I was wincing at Danny having his teeth ripped out. Oh my god. No, I can't get through here. I'm not supposed to go through that vent, am I? Oh, is it this way? Is it this way? No, no, where the fuck am I going? Where the f 
It must be, it has to be in here. What? Oh my god, oh my god, I see it. Oh my god. Shit, Diego. Not fucking oh, right. Jesus. Um. Oh, shit. Oh, God. Oh, my. Fucking Jesus. Oh, fuck. I'm just gonna have to go. I'm just gonna have to go. Get out, get out. Come on, Danny. What? Ah. Fucking Jesus. Oh my god, get out of there. Oh my... Fucking shit. No, 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 I can't go that way. Do I, do I have to go that way? I'm gonna have to go that way. Oh my god. What the hell just happened? Seriously. Oh my god. Danny, get under the water. Jesus. What the f- I've literally just got out of there, what the f- Leave me alone, man. Oh, I'm ranked 10. Get in. Juan, we're burned. Castillo was waiting. He and his fucking head had out to try to kill me. Glad you made it. I, uh, I have to ask. Did you talk, Danny? Not a fucking word. Once a guerrilla, always a guerrilla. The kid, Diego. He saved my life. What? Shaw Danton's headed out dead. Old dog? Binga. This is good. This is very good. We are playing 4D chess in space now, Danny. <laughs> what the fuck chess, does that buddy. mean? I just got my molars ripped out. Same oh. thing to me back in the Congo. Except I did it to myself. Just chew in the front like a rabbit. And Juan, let's leave Clara out of it. We got burned. That's all she needs to know. Clara's not enough to fucking deal with, let alone you almost getting torn to pieces. Gracias. Jesus Christ, yes, yeah, so I was wincing like mad when he came for the molars and ripping the teeth out, man. I'm not good with stuff like that. But then Diego shot him in the head. I'm like, honestly, I nearly lost my sh I nearly fell off the bloody chair. Cra honestly, I was not expecting that. Yeah, so I think it's time we got back on with some of these missions. I'm not feeling this yet. Um, so it must be El Tigre. Unless we have one for La Moral. Now Maximus Matanzas. Um, I will help these farmers. Um, that does seem like a good one to do, but I think El Tigre is the, is the one we do next. Jesus Christ, I was not expecting this on the mission, man. I was just expecting to do sort of three supply drops. One tell me some shit jokes. Have a laugh, to be honest. Right, um... Where's El Tigre? He's up here, isn't he? Oh, but Danny is one tough SOB, man, to go through that. Jesus. I did, I, honestly, I'd have just told him everything. I'm, I'm no good with that sort of stuff. Just watching it was enough for me. put a lot of guerrillas back together. Gracias. Lucky appreciates them, too. Even if she doesn't show it. And bringing La Morale was smart. This camp needs young blood. Shakes things up. Now we need to work on Lorenzo. Half the abuelos out there hang on his every word. Honron said Lorenzo should visit a BioVita facility. But getting Lorenzo to do anything is like pulling a tank through the mud, sideways. I'm going to give him a little reminder of what we stood for. And you are going to bring the BioVita to him. All you got to do is tiptoe in, take photographs of anything suspicious, and get out. For a so-called research facility, they have way more guns than lab coats down there. They're hiding something, baby Tigre, and we're going to slap Lorenzo in the face with whatever it is. All right, so it sounds like a mission I definitely cannot do, Hold which is be silent. <laughs> Did not say what you could say, no filters. Brilliant. Uh, I mean, I'm gonna have to travel there anyway.
What do you kids say? Here it is, let me just... No filter? <laughs> Brilliant. <laughs> right, where can we get a vehicle? We can only get these. Alright, I'll go for the helipad pickup then. So let's go fly in, I suppose. Um, so it does say that we need to tiptoe in, be quiet, uh, get some photos, and then get out. So that's what I'm hoping to do. I'm hoping it's going to be a nice, quiet one, but uh, I imagine it's not going to be that easy. Nothing ever is. And honestly, I'm a little bit scared of getting captured again, because if it wasn't for Diego, I wouldn't be alive. And honestly, when he threw, when he took the grenade, I honestly thought that was I was going to be it or something. Jesus Christ! We've been through the ringer today, guys. All right, it's not actually that far away, so I'm all right with this. Um, it's when they're like the other side of the map or something. I just Oh, mongoose hunting space. Um, yeah, when I do the side of the map, I just think, why? Why get me over there, man? I mean, aren't we in it supposed to be, you know, all this sort of area or something? Right, I may want to sort of try and land in this sort of field here, because there's there's a lot of people there. Baby Tigre, while you're at the facility, there's someone I want you to look for. Who? All right. Her name's Gabriella. She's a girl from the fishing village. Used to bring us food and supplies. Lorenzo used to tease her for her tattoos and her crazy hair colors. We loved her visits, until one day she told us she had some good news and said she'd be leaving Yara. That was the last time we saw Gabriella. My neighbor thought he saw her at that Biovira place. Tattoos and colorful hair. I'll keep an eye out for her. Gracias. I'm worried something terrible has happened. Oh, what's this? Search you for evidence, yeah. Take out your phone, aim at the target, press RB to take a photo. Right, okay. So, realistically, we. I'm worried something terrible has happened. Realistically, we don't need to kill anyone. The camera needs to go. Do you see suffering and pain? Can we get in here? Yeah. Weird. We call them legends of 67, they call them the murderers of 67, so you know. I suppose there's two sides to every story, you know. Have to be careful. Right, let me just, uh... Gone. Try to call back up now. Oh no. No one needed to die. I just tried to shoot the bloody alarm and that was it. I didn't kill anyone, did I? No, I don't think I killed anyone. I'm sorry, they deserve it, man. Is there anyone this way that I can see yet? So far I'm doing a decent job of taking them out, but uh, I came in not really wanting to take people out. No, wrong one. What a shot, man, if I do say so myself. Nice, gone. Happy. Alright. Need to take photos of what they were doing. Alright. Um, 
pick that up. Can I pick it up? Yeah. Facility key card. So something, somewhere is going to need a key card. No, no. So there are still some more guards. What is going on here? Yeah, I need to get in and see. I have the key card, here we go. Alright, first of all. Come on, be somewhat decent. Oh, the bow. I mean, it's not really that bad. I was probably going to get it anyway. Medicine. So something in here is probably going to need a picture taken, isn't it? Oh. Sounds came from in there. They've got a bad feeling about this place. Yeah. Nothing screams. Oh, Jesus. Nothing screams weird, sicko like. Sort of an underground bloody lair. All this bullshit about treating cancer. Bosnia. They're using humans like rats. What right. are they testing? Castillo's not going to get away with this. I need more pigs. Right. Let's go to the next zone then. Um, okay, so there are some... Uh, some peeps still here. see you. Right, so somewhere around here then. Something else, that probably this. Those look like gauges. Yeah. That's what, what drew me to it straight away. These people are sick. Really sick. What the... F Oh god, man, she's picks. bloody foaming at the mouth. Uh, female difficult to determine if severe internal bleeding was due to treatment. What? Or oh, miscarry? Oh, Jesus, man. Yeah, there was no way that you could just sneak around all of this, you know? Thinking about it now. What is that red smoke? No. Um. All right. It's gonna be bodies or something, isn't it? There's something under the water. It's gonna be bodies. What the fuck is in the ring? So many. Bodies. Yeah. Oh God. This should be enough to convince Lorenzo. Yeah, but I am still trespassing. But I won't be trespassing somewhere around here. So once I'm not trespassing, I can probably fast travel. You won't believe what they're doing to our people. It's horrific. Oh, I believe it. But it's Lorenzo who needs convincing. And what about Gabriella? Nothing. I don't know what to tell you. She's gone. Photos back to camp. It's time for Lorenzo to wake up. Let's go. Should be able to fast travel. Yeah. Here we go. 
So we need to take these photos back now so Lorenzo can actually see what's going on. I don't know anyone that could believe in this sort of regime after seeing these, you know? We were just kids, El Tigre. <laughs> <laughs> Lorenzo, I took pictures of that place Horon was talking about. You swipe to the left. They look free to you. Man. This is what Libertad and La Moral are fighting. You can hate us, but at least we're doing something about it. No one deserves this, Lorenzo. This is happening all over Yara. You just can't see it from so high up this mountain. I can't look at this anymore. I didn't vote for Castillo. The war is over. So that was a waste? That's the end. end. You shook the tree. Sometimes shaking a tree is all you need to get some fruit, you know? Uh, so, oh, we're still in slow-mo. Bullet points, that's the next operation it looks like. But for today, guys, that is going to do it. Uh, I really hope you enjoyed this video. I did and didn't because it was some really grimacing moments, but it was some absolutely shockers in this, man. So if you like the video, please leave a like and subscribe. It really helps me out. And I will see you all in the next video. Thanks, guys.